this is Kathy. So today I want to share more about the Chinese zodiac. So in this dragon year, what we can do to attract more lucky or make us more healthy? Uh, because different uh, uh, animal sign in this dragon year had a different uh, lucky, different way, right? So now we begin with the ox year. If you're born in ox year in this year, so this is a dragon, uh, try to accumulate your energy. Don't do too much. So keep calm. At this time, maybe a little bit easier to get sick in this year. So pay attention to high blood pressure. Uh, blood sugar and the cholesterol so we need more exercise right so that's I said don't do keep calm that uh, still means you need to do more exercise calm means your mind calm but the body need exercise also pay attention to your spine issues so could do more some of my stretching exercise your relationship seems pretty good you have very good relationship with other people and uh, doesn't matter with your family, with your spouse, with your partner, or with your boss, with your employee, all seems pretty good. So that's a good sign. So try to don't argue with people. That's for the people who are born in the year ox. So now we talk about uh, year rabbit. For year rabbit, since you have a lot of uh, that uh, small wells coming by itself, that's good, right? <laughs> Not big one, but a small one. Pay attention to your head issues. Maybe you have a lot of headache, so try to get more rest. Moderate your stress level, right? You seems have a lot of uh, um, either your boy. If your boy, you have a lot of uh, maybe female friends. If you're a girl, you have a lot of uh, male friends coming to you. But make sure not to rush to get married yet. Try to be more positive. Don't think too much. Just focus at this moment. Because we all ha could have a lot of negative thoughts, right? So try to be more focused on the positive things and focus at this moment. That's for the people who are born in the year rabbit. So now next, we talk about for people who are born in the year of a dog. Year of dog in this dragon year also seems the, the lucky or this career, everything is so-so. So try don't be too greedy, slow down. And it seems at this year, people that uh, born in dog year, in this dragon year, they have some creative ability. You can pay attention, for example, arts, joy, music. So try to pay attention to those kind of things. Try to avoid getting new friends in this year. Try to get uh, keep your old friend. So because if you get too much new friends, it may be easier to have some arguments. So that's not good for our health, right? For the people who are born in dog year, in this dragon year, try to get more travel. So go out, make you feel happy. Don't stay in one place. Sometimes you will feel depressed. And don't touch metal, especially sharp metal, okay? For the people who are born in the dog year. So next, for people born in rat year, Have good relationship, that's a good sign. So keep your old relationship, it's very good, it's very stable. Pay attention to your respiratory system issues. You seem to have a lot of things you want to do, you could do, just do it, but keep your balance, your working, your rest, your health. So don't do too much new things. So keep the old 
whatever you did before, keep it and gradually, gradually develop it, make it better. So for the people, this is for the people who born in the right year, in this dragon year, what we should pay attention. Now we talk about people born in tiger year. So in this dragon year, what we can do? Also, don't try to do new development. Keep it uh, as steadily, as stable as much as you can. If you have some new career, career, some new idea, try to keep for next year. So for this dragon year, try to keep your original steps. Good relationship seems good. And uh, pay attention to those people who who have too much negative thoughts, so keep distance with them. That's very important for people who are Tiger Year, who were born in Tiger Year. Your career, your well seems okay, but still try to work more harder to get some income from your career. You need to work harder. <laughs> okay, and the feelings. For your relationship, maybe you could have some new relationship that seems pretty good for a tiger year. Okay, now we talk about uh, people who were born in the snack year. Snack year. So this year seems you have very good energy. So you could uh, do the new career if you want. For, for the people who were born in snack year, in this dragon year, pretty good. This year is a lucky year. It's your lucky year. And you seem to have some very famous or some important uh, male people offer you help. So that seems a, a sign. You could get some help. Good relationship. Try to make sure you have good sleep. You may have some insomnia issues. So make sure go to bed early, get enough exercise during the daytime. That's very important, right? Get enough sun expo exposure to the sun during the daytime if you want to have a good quality of sleep. So that's the thing you have to pay attention. And also people probably easy to get stress, anxiety for people who born in snack year, in this dragon year. So you do have a, a lot of new things, new opportunity. At the same time, try to keep balance for the snack year. Then we talk about for the people who were born in the horse year. In horse year, also don't do too much development, new development. Keep it uh, the original things as much as you can. Your health seems pretty good. This year, for people who were born in horse year, so this dragon year seems to have very good uh, life energy so your health seems pretty good and also had a very good relationship it's it's good you have new friend could uh, find some new friend to 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 get along with each other will be no problem so horse year also good year in this dragon year now we talk about uh, goat year people who were born in goat year It seems everything not that clear. So pay attention, especially to the relationship. Sometimes you're not quite sure it's good or bad. So just pay more attention. Be more cautious for people who are born in goat year, in this dragon year. And pay attention to your, you know, to your stomach or uh, your waist health. So try not to get injured and watch out your digestive system. Don't eat too much cold stuff. Salad, avoid tropical fruits, for example. Or maybe you have some energy issues. So energy issues, according to Chinese medicine, also closely related to stomach issues. So pay more attention to your stomach issues. If you want to do some investment, be more cautious. Things the wealth will come, but come slowly. Okay, for people who are born in goat year. And another thing, 
good things for people born in gold year is that they probably have some female people want to come to help you. So just accept that help. Okay. So now we talk about the monkey year. So people who were born in monkey year in this dragon year, what we can do if you make it stable, don't be too aggressive. Okay. If you had some good investment, just to finish. Okay. Don't try to be more aggressive. Keep it stable. Avoid drink alcohol. Pay attention to your headache, to your neck issues at this year. Okay. Uh, you may have a poor relationship, so be more patient with your partner, with your spouse, with your friends. Be more, be more patient. Okay? For people who were born in monkey year. So you probably have a lot of argument because this relationship is difficult to write. So pay more attention, be more cautious, and be more patient. Okay, that's it for the people who were born in monkey year. So next, people who were born in rooster year. The rooster year seems this year is a lucky year for you, this uh, dragon year. You seem to have some special protection from God, from universe, <laughs> for people who were born in, in the rooster year. So dragon year is a lucky year. You seem to have some good relationship will come in maybe next, uh, hot, next uh, after, after June or July, you may have. Still avoid alcohol, no alcohol. Okay. You may have some vision issues, so try to avoid too much screen time. Blink more. <laughs> and don't easy to lose your temper. That's also important for the people who born in the uh, rooster year. You have good relationship, so that's pretty good. So let me repeat, avoid alcohol, pay attention to your vision issues or your leg issues. So you may will have some knee pain, so pay attention to that. And uh, generally speaking, you're pretty lucky in this dragon year. You have some protection from God, from universe, so your career maybe will be very smooth. So that's a good sign. So now we talk about uh, people who were born in pig year. So pig year seems everything's good. That's uh, in this dragon year. Your relationship, your career, your, your health, everything seems okay. So probably people who were born in pig year, this number one, number two in this dragon year. So don't need to pay more attention and you all have a lot of help from other people. So just accept it happily. Okay. So for people who are born in pig year, that's a lucky year in this dragon. So last we talk about uh, people who are born in dragon year, in this dragon year, who are born in dragon. So that means we, we call it, uh, it's our fate year. So like me, this is my fate year. So if you are 24, 36, 48, 60, so this is your fate year. You are your dragon and also this is a dragon year, right? So for this year, you know, we have to be more cautious, like me. More cautious about everything, about your relationship, about your career, about, you know, the, the, the traffic. <laughs> about uh, walking in the kitchen. This is sharp knife, be more cautious. And your health too. So this year is not a good year, generally speaking for us. But it's not that bad. So for example, I have so many this uh, <laughs> red color stuff. So this, according to Chinese zodiac theory, this red color could dispel this evil spirit. Try to get more red color this uh, jewelry or this kind of small things put on your in your pocket on your purse right so this red color could uh, give you some protection but good things is maybe next year 
the, we will be probably the best. <laughs> okay, the best lucky year next year. So just be patient. And for example, this year for the dragon people, try to avoid spicy food. No argument, more agreeable with other people. Because when you argue with people, probably you're easy to lose temper and then make things worse. So try to be more understandable to other people. Try to be more supportive to your spouse, to your partner. Be more nice to them, okay? And get up early, go to bed early. For me, I go to bed around 10, get up around 6, right? Don't uh, go to bed too late. That will be very bad for our health. Still, you need uh, more study, read more books, enhance yourself, right? Make your increase your ability, make you more capable of doing things. And don't task, don't take any risky things. Don't go too much adventure as this year. But you could go out to travel. That's no problem. Traveling is good for us this year. But don't do adventure, especially as too, too dangerous, like a cliff climbing, right? Or jumping, all those things. So in the world, for people who were born in dragon year, this dragon year, we have to be more cautious, more careful about everything, more agreeable with other people, take care of our health more. Like for example, for your partner, for your husband, for your wife, try to be more, pay attention to them, to their feelings, and do more contribute to the family. That's very important for us in this year. Of course, generally speaking, it's, it's important for all of us, right? To pay attention to your family, to your partner, to respect them, what they, what their feelings, right? You have to be more cautious if you want a, a good relationship. But this year is more important, especially for the people who were born in Dragon Year. This is Chinese Zodiac. Personal opinion, don't take it too serious. For example, oh, this year is my lucky year. I could do whatever I want to do. Oh, this year is not my lucky year. I, I cannot do anything. I just stay home. It's not like that, right? We always be try to be nice to people, offer help to people if you could offer help. And be nice, be kind, respect everybody, follow the natural rule. Go to bed early, wake up early if during the summertime. And eat healthy food, whole food, fresh foods, organic foods, seasonal food, local foods. And regular exercise. That's always important, right? So that's my opinion. Just to give you some idea what we can do if according to a Chinese zodiac rule. Hope you like it. <laughs> okay.